could have sworn I saw a ball sack. I could have sworn I saw a ball sack. Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. So this is gonna be a gender reveal vlog, but today is Saturday, September, September the 26th. And hold on, my son is calling me. And we're actually doing the gender reveal tomorrow, but we are on the way to get an ultrasound. I'm, I'm with my baby daddy, say nah. I'm with my boo thing. Say hey to my vlog, babe. Sorry for the bumpiness. We're in the car. So let me just give y'all a. Well, I wanted to um pretty much start it today, right? Because I wanted to pretty much like show y'all. This is the. Yeah. You can go straight right here. I just wanted to get some footage of the ultrasound that we're about to go do. I don't even know if they're going to allow us to record in there, but I'm going to try. So, let me just give y'all a little backstory on finding out the gender of the twins. No, I don't have my seatbelt on. Let me put it on before somebody say something. Okay, so like three weeks ago to three and a half weeks ago, I had like the gender reveal test where they actually draw blood from your test, from, from, I said from your test. They draw blood to find out the, the sex of the baby and stuff like that. So I waited two weeks, two whole weeks to find out what the results were. And then they called me and said, hey, Miss Harris, we're sorry, we didn't have enough blood. We need you to come in so you can give some more. So I came in that morning to give some more blood. And when I got there, y'all, will y'all believe after this lady took my freaking blood, she dropped the tubes on the floor. So they were in glass tubes, so they spilt everywhere. So she had to draw my blood again. So at this point, this is the third time. Then after I got that done, y'all, after I got that done, then the doctor gonna call me the next day and say, oh, Miss Harris, it, this time we had enough blood, but there wasn't enough. I think she said like DNA cells, something it wasn't enough of for them to tell what the gender was. So at this point I'm pissed off because I'm like, y'all done took all my precious blood and y'all can't even tell me what I'm having. So, um, what I did was I went ahead and I booked an appointment with this place called Hello Baby where they do the gender reveal results via ultrasound as early as 16 weeks. So I went ahead and booked that. That's where we are on our way to now. But this is the kicker. So today is Saturday. On Tuesday, the Tuesday that just passed, I'm just sitting here scrolling on my phone and I get an email saying you your test results have been uploaded and I'm like what test results I haven't even had no test done so I went on you know to the, to the little web portal to see what the test results were and I'm glad that it was like two sheets two like a cover sheet and then the second sheet was the actual results because when I seen the cover sheet I saw that the 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 header was from the company that actually did my DNA testing um, for the gender via blood. So I was like, oh shoot, I think that this might be the gender results, but I didn't know. I was like, maybe these are just the, like saying, Miss Harris, we weren't able to get the results or something like that, but I didn't want to take no chances. So what I did was I screenshot that, I screenshot that page and sent it to my sister and then asked her, you know, was these the results? They were the, the, the gender results. So we got those in. But I still wanna do this appointment with the ultrasound because for one, um, dad has not seen the babies yet at all. And as far as like in person, he's only seen the ultrasound via FaceTime and you know FaceTime be blurry, choppy connection all of that so it's like he haven't seen it live and in person and I want him to be able to experience you know this just like I've experienced it because you know they coronavirus they ain't letting nobody in the appointments so I'm happy because I'm ready to see my babies I haven't seen them since 
nine weeks. Now they're supposed to be avocados. And I'm just excited. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get them to actually confirm um, one, the gender. I'm not gonna let them tell me because I still wanna do like the gender reveal at my mom's. But I'm gonna get them to confirm the gender just so I can make sure once I little pop the little thing, I can confirm that it matches what they're showing on the ultrasound and for two when you do the blood the the when you get the gender via um, blood if it's twins they can't tell you which twin is which so say for instance it's a boy and a girl they can't tell you which twin is a boy which twin is a girl so that's what I want them to confirm here I want to know what baby A is and what baby B is okay so that's my little spiel that's what we're on our way to now and are you excited <laughs> what do you want? What, what? Two girls, two girls. I already knew that. I just wanted him to tell y'all. He uh he he keeps saying they're girls over and over again. And I'm pretty sure they're gonna be girls because everything he have said he spoke into existence. He know what I mean when I say that, but I'ma leave that for another story. <laughs> but we'll see you all when we get there. That one is that live right there, yeah. right now? Oh, I'm like a little alien right now. <laughs> baby tell how his uh his how, did you did you like the ultrasound did you enjoy it for the first time seeing the babies yep <laughs> i enjoy seeing my babies baby b move around the whole time i uh, know y'all baby b was the one that was taking over the whole show baby a did not want to move at all they Couldn't were move. He was yeah pushing. she was like b b is on top of a and um b was just like <laughs> Every time she would try to get a like a video of A, B was just taking over. Like I don't know if it's a he or she, but I keep wanting to say he because I feel like you know I'm just used to saying he because I have boys. But um, yeah, she was able to tell the gender of both, and of course we still don't know until tomorrow. But we are excited. We're, we we can't wait to find out. And yeah, once we find out, then it's like. Then we can prepare on how you know names and even though we already picked out names that we still got to talk about ain't nothing to talk about <laughs> but yeah so all right i just wanted to come check back in you guys huh you better not start speaking like them i ride like them they're going i was 70 something like this but i just wanted to come check back in with y'all and we'll see y'all. Why am I blurry like this? Better? Yep. And we will see y'all tomorrow for the gender reveal. I'm so excited. Just know. You know, I ain't gonna say it till tomorrow. I'll see y'all for the gender reveal. Only 
of his girls. Before <laughs> we check it back. We you check we, it. we gonna check back here before we go though. It's gonna be it's a girl in there. I feel like it's a girl in there somewhere. I feel it. I feel it in my bones. I know it's not gonna be I really he he said that he feel like it's two it's a boy and a girl. And I I already said I feel like it's a boy and a girl. But when we had the ultrasound, it looked like one of them because like she took she like turned the TV off so we couldn't see when she was checking for the gender. But of course, when she's like just showing us the anatomy of the baby and pictures like that, you know, she's trying to avoid that area, but you always keep. And I could have sworn I saw a ball sack. I could have sworn I saw a ball sack, but I don't know. So we will see tomorrow. I'm excited to be experiencing this with my baby, even though you trapped me. <laughs> Definitely did. <laughs> all right, we'll see y'all tomorrow. All right, you guys. So today is the day of the gender oh. reveal. Here's my family all walking around looking like mass men. <laughs> and we are, uh, we're about to, we're not going to make this a long drawn out. Y'all ready? <laughs> huh? We're going to have the gender reveal to find out what your siblings are. What is that? <laughs> the, si the siblings in my stomach, right here. Oh. <laughs> Y'all ready? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Can y'all see? Wait, me... You want to do it right there? Yeah. Tasha, make sure the camera can see me. Can the camera? Yeah. Won't you come come up closer? You can't go. I sure loud. hope it's girls. <laughs> I do too. Can they see me? Yeah. Can me loud. Yeah, they can see you. They can see you. Come here, babe. Why y'all look? No. <laughs> Hello, uh, Dad. <laughs> you, but this camera look. You look far on this camera. You can zoom in, but I want to make sure I can do the color. I, yo, okay. Mommy. Zoom in on this thing right here, up top. Mommy. All right. Well, you might it's be fine like that. Then. It's a girl. If it's pink, it's girls. If I it's know girls, who it's a boy. It's, a it's boy. Oh, All right. Two oh, pinks. You got to look at the, the thing to see which way to turn it. Huh? Look okay. at the arrow to see which way to turn it. It's going to be loud. Brian, you there. Okay. Boy and a girl. Boy and a girl. Oh my god. <laughs> mm. I told all of you. I told you every single yeah. one of you. I told every single one of you. Yeah, you got another <laughs> grandson. <laughs> Multiplying, I've been 